Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Astroneer. Ooh, okay, so when I last worked on the factory, you know, it, it became pretty apparent to all of us, I think, that I really need to set up a good supply of lithium. And I put it to you guys. I said, what do you want me to do? Do you want me to go set up a supply line on the other planets, like for the uh, iron and the titanium? Or, or do you want me to set up a... Oh God, I got this last time. I love this thing so much. Or do you want me to set up a supply line for this, for, uh, for resin, to keep this supplied and do it with scrap? Now, the majority of you said do a supply line for lithium on Vasania. And that's a that's an absolutely valid option. But there were also quite a few people who said, hey, you know what? It'd be kind of fun to see you do it with uh, with scrap to set up a supply line for the resin. And so I I want to do both. Honestly, I have I have plans. I have plans for this to expand it, to make it more efficient and to make it less prone to bugging out. So I want to do both. I figured first, so I got to do this again. I've got to, <laughs> I love this thing so much. <laughs> this is great. Got this last time, last episode. Fantastic. Anyway, yes, um, I'm going to gather the things needed to set up a supply line on Vasania. I don't think it's going to be terribly interesting because you've seen me do it already several times now. So I'll do a real fast forward version of it. And if anything interesting happens along the way, I'll stop and we can admire whatever chaos or issue has occurred or whatever hole I've fallen in, as seems quite likely. <laughs> yeah, for now. For now, I'm going to get to work building what I need, set up to Vasania, and I'll see you on the other side. And done! Okay, lithium supply line has been established. We've got two auto miners down there hammering away, collecting quite a decent amount of lithium. And we've got the uh, the train set up and running. Fantastic. All right, back to silver and on with the second part of today's plan. It's so pretty watching this come into land. Okay, what are we going to need? Well, we're going to need a good deposit of resin. We're going to need another uh, another couple of auto extractors. And we're going to need a whole bunch of railway tracks and, and, and train cars and stuff just to bring all of the lovely resin over to here. I suppose I could even get rid of that, really, because the resin's just going to be delivered straight to this arm. Okay, all right. Better start, uh, 
start building some stuff. All right, as we've done for all the other extraction points, I want to do more than one auto extractor. I'm thinking though, honestly, here to do the resin, we might want three on one deposit. Resin deposits are pretty big and the auto extractors are very, very slow. So I think if we have three going, that should be a decent uh, a decent rate of collection, I think. I mean, the little arm over there can build, uh, can make the canisters at the speed of sound. It's so fast. So I don't think, I don't think, you know, three per minute or whatever it is you get from, from three auto extractors is gonna be enough, but it's a start, right? It's a start and we can go from there. Also, we're gonna need rubber, which, I think it's organic and resin. Cool, 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 cool. That's all of the uh, all the steel. Now let's go with the rubber. And the other thing I think was tungsten carbide, which is carbon and tungsten. There's the tungsten. Thank you. Oh, how much have we got of that actually? Oh, this is my last piece of it. Wow, that worked out perfectly. Ha. Huh. I'm gonna need some more uh, wolframite, I think it is. It makes tungsten. Yeah, wolframite, because um, yeah, I, I need I need more. I need more. <laughs> there you go, there you go. Lovely. Right, what else are we gonna need? Okay, so what's that? That's the, oh, it's the buggy. That's the buggy. We're gonna need auto arms. So I've got the auto arms there. Let's bring those over. Yeah. Also, 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 I packaged up the <laughs> I packaged up the VTOL. Ugh. Brought it back from DeSolo. So we can use that to help find um, to help find our target resin patch. Oh gosh, that's that's gonna be great. No, stop it. Stop it. We're going up now. Whee! <laughs> oh, dude. Dude. That's so cool. I better land before I waste all the fuel, though. Lovely. Now, that can't carry those, but it can carry, like, a bunch of the smaller things. So, actually, I can grab this and put those on there and that on that. Yep. Perfection. Absolute perfection. Lovely. This is all coming together very nicely. We are going to need a third auto arm though, which is, oh gosh, it's graphite and aluminium. Graphite and aluminium, of which we still have, is that aluminium? Yeah, we still have a lot. I don't know why, whenever I look at those labels, I have such a hard time immediately seeing what it is that's stored inside it. Maybe there's something wrong with my <laughs> visual processing. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, let's build that. Uh, uh, are we missing something? Oh yeah, there it is. There's the tungsten carbide. And we're gonna need another exochip as well. I'm just gonna pop that stuff there for the moment. Lovely, put you in there. And we're gonna need a bunch of platforms for the auto arms to sit on. And that's all resin. Just make a bunch of those like that. Excellent. They can go on to the VTOL as well. It's now our flying transport. I love it. I think I left the truck up here. I did, I did, I did, I did, okay. We're gonna need this. Whoops, Daisy. We're gonna need this for bringing the uh, auto extractors to wherever we decide to set up the auto extraction, which I really wanna be over in that direction because that's the side of the base that I've got the shredder set up on. So I'd really like it to be over that way somewhere instead of over that way. But you know, whatever we have to do, we will deal with it, won't we folks? I'm sure we'll figure it out. Let's pump it up. Cool. Excellent. Next one is ready. Let's get the third one printing. You know, we might need more than three. We might need more than three if we're going to keep this scrap supplied. But, but, 
but there is a bottleneck in this system which may actually help. So the shredder can only process, oh, you know what? Oh, I could build more than one shredder. <gasps> yes. Yes, I could build more than one shredder. Okay. Yeah, we might need more than three auto extractors then. <laughs> We might need much, much more resin flowing through. All right, while that thing's printing, we may as well go scouting. Because I don't... I can't think of what else I need. Oh, train tracks. That's okay. Oh, hey, there's a patch right there. Well, that's handy. Okay, so there's a patch right there. Gosh, this thing gets loud. I wonder if there's any other... Oh, there's a patch right there too. Oh, there's one there. Okay, no, that's cool. Oh, I love this. I love the sunrise. I love the sunrise in this game. Oh, that's so pretty. Ah, uh, sorry. Okay. Yep. Sorry. Biz what, what are we doing? Stuff over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, you're so loud. You're so loud. Why is it so loud? What do we need for rail lines? I wanted to use the the raised ones. Tall rail post bundle, resin and aluminium. Okay, I want to use the tall ones for this resin and aluminium because I'd like to still be able to drive under them I assume I assume the tall ones are tall enough to uh, to drive under was it resin and aluminium yeah yeah, yeah. I'll do two bundles two bundles should be enough at least for now so so we need to do a little bit of rearranging over here I think so that we can accept in our new goods you know, it's about time I closed up all these death pits because <laughs> you guys haven't seen it because I haven't shown it, but I've fallen in there so many times. I've died down there at least three times, just not looking where I was going and falling straight into that death pit. Uh, I really should have just closed it off a long time ago, but you know, I had better things to do. But now we're here, now we're here, now it matters. So we'll fix it, we'll fix it while we make this area more suitable for the uh, large scale production of, what is it? Canisters, yes. I reckon that'll do it, you know. I reckon that's a good, good large area to do this in. Okay, so, gonna need another one of these. More arms, more platforms. That platform, is that the best for this? Is that gonna be the best for this? What if we have one of the larger platforms that has that on it and a couple of arms on it? Maybe that'd be better? Could even have a platform that has two of these on it. Ooh, that could be efficient for space. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Sorry, I know I'm not making a lot of sense. I'm kind of planning this in my head as I go. Uh, is that what I want? Yes. And a trade platform. Uh, oh, oh, hang on. I've already got an auto extractor there. Hey, I didn't realize I must have built too many. Now I can place a fourth one. Ooh. Uh, but for now, for now, let's, uh, let's get this done. Yes, this thing, this thing will do. Ooh. I, uh... Actually, now that I think about it, can it actually have two of those giant shredders on it? Maybe this can only have one of the giant shredders on it. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think... Where the heck did I get this from? Oh, I had it in my backpack. <laughs> Uh, yeah, because what's that on? Yeah, okay. And there's another one there, because that's on four linked with four, whereas this has got a four linked with four in the middle and then two by two on the sides. So that's not going to do. Do I need it to be the giant shredder, though? I could probably get away with a medium shredder on there. And that way I could use this. And that. Hmm. Okay, I've decided that large platform, that really large platform, is not the way. But 
We do need a platform for it. We also need another one. So exochips, tungsten carbide, steel. The platform itself is going to be iron and ceramic. Let's get that one done first, I reckon. I am loving this hoverboard, by the way. Especially because you can manipulate things while you're using it. Unlike the other, you know, actual vehicles. You can't touch anything. But with this... With this wonderful thing, you can. And I love it. This is great. Whee! Alright, there's a there's a whole bunch of stuff being built there. There's that stuff being, you know, what's that? What's that? What do you call that? Being produced, I guess? Yeah, 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 let's go with produced. So for right now, I think it would be a really good idea. Wait, I don't need this, I need that. <laughs> I think it'd be a really good idea to go start setting up the uh, the auto extractors and etc. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I've made this so dangerous. That was probably not the best idea, but uh, yes, it, it is what it is now. I was never really planning to need to drive out here all that much, so you know. We're going to start with this patch. That's decent. I mean, that's good enough anyway. So yeah, let's go that. Yeah. Wow. Okay. See, there's, this looks like a lot of resin, but it's still only really showing a tiny bit. But that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We're going to have three of these things going on here. It's really okay. So you go, you go there, my friend. Yep, you go there. And we've got this third one. And then that fourth one that I discovered that we've got back at base, we can use it another patch. So, you know, we're not... We're not restricted to just one patch. We can have multiple patches and multiple rail lines and, 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 and all that good stuff. Yeah, this is going to be great. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. So those are all going to put out output. Output, not put out. Goodness me. They're all going to output to there-ish. Uh, yep. Yep. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah. Now... Now I need what's on the flying machine because it's got all the rails and everything like that on it. Oh, can I make this? Can I make this? <laughs> yeah. Uh, hmm. I'm gonna start making this place so dangerous. Uh, Okie dokie. Away we go. Again, no idea why this thing is so loud, but it is. That's so loud. Uh, anyway, anyway, rail post bundle, yes. Gonna want arm and platform. How many did I pack? Yeah, 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 cool. I packed three of each, which is what I needed. So, you, 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 you. <laughs> you're going on there, you're going on there. Get this last one. You're going on there. All right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I think we could do it. I think we could do it. So you... Can you reach... You may not be able to reach everything on that extractor. What about there? And there. Yeah, I think that'll reach... Yeah, yeah, that should reach everything on the extractor. And those all output to roughly the same spot. Right there. Yep. Yep, and yep. I may need to bring in one of the lower tracks just for this final point. Because I don't know, uh, oh gosh, that's that's actually quite tall, that's really cool. Okay, I don't know if these can place onto something that's up there. I think they can, I think they can, because I've seen them do it. Yeah, I want you to rotate that way. Wait, 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 what? To what? 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 Why? Why? Why is it low? Why? <laughs> What's happening? Oh, I've got a normal rail post bundle there. Oh, that's why. Okay, so, uh, yeah, 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 cool. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I didn't actually need all that many. The patch is very close, which is brilliant. That makes this so much easier. Um, let's, well, hmm, okay, let's fly this thing home. Because I know there's stuff on this that I need. Oh, hello, going through the tracks, it's fine. Just phasing through things, Not nothing to worry about, nothing to see here. I basically need to clear all this out because I know what I want to do. I know how I want this to be. And I think, I think 
in heavy, heavy quotation marks, I think I can make this work. So, uh, <laughs> we will see. Oh yeah, also, I finally figured out what I'm gonna do with this thing. I can actually use it in this build. That's, um, yeah, I, I mean, I know exactly what they're for. I've just never found a use for it in this base. But now, now, now I have a use for it. So these are gonna be right next to each other, right there. Yeah, oh, more or less right next to each other. Right? Yeah, like that, like that. Uh, oh, I need to build the other, uh, what's that called? Shredder, the other gigantic shredder. Extra large shredder, two exo chips, tungsten carbide and steel. That's easy, I'm pretty sure I remember how to make all those. That makes steel and tungsten carbide. That's gonna be, oh right, we're out of tungsten. Oh no. Uh, crap. Right, quick little trip to DeSolo to get some Wolframite so we can make some tungsten. Because apparently I forgot from, you know, 10 minutes ago that I'm completely out of tungsten. But that's okay, it's fine. You know, <gasps> oh, I forgot about that death hole there. Oh my gosh, why, why do I make things so dangerous for myself? Why do I, am I, am I just like a risk, is this, is this telling me that I'm a risk taker or something? Cause it's kind of feeling like it's telling me that I'm a risk taker cause I take all these unnecessary risks or, or I'm just really lazy and can't be bothered uh, filling in these holes unless absolutely necessary. Honestly, I think that one's more likely. Five minutes later. I found one. I found exactly one Wolframite, but that's enough. That's enough to build the shredder and continue with the plan. This was just a slight detour. Everything is fine. Nothing is ruined. So what did you do today, honey? Oh, you know, just nipped over to the moon for a single block of one resource that I ran out of. Oh, that's, that's interesting. Why'd you do that? Ah, oh, because I'm a Muppet and I didn't plan ahead. All right. Process that, please. So that's the steel. Uh, it needs two exo chips. So plug those in, one and two. And I think, yeah, the tungsten carbide is the, is the only other thing that it needs. Give, 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 thank you. All right, uh, carbon? Carbon, yeah, 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 carbon. So tungsten carbide, tungsten carbide. Thank you very much, Lee. There you get on with building that thing, you. Grab those, and can I carry these things while on the skateboard? What? <laughs> oh my gosh, the skateboard is the best thing ever. Uh, what do we need <laughs> next? So, we're gonna need those. Yeah, 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 yeah. So need to, I'll have two of those, in fact. That actually needs to move even further away. That's in the way there. You. And you. Now try and position these so that this arm kind of overlaps them both. I think we, I think we can do this. I think we can do this fairly easily. Does that, that overlap them both? I think it does. Ooh. Now the question is, can it grab stuff on the other side just by virtue of being there? So, well, let's, yeah. Yeah, let's test it. Nah. <laughs> Raspberries. Okay, okay, so second plan. Second plan. Um, okay, okay, look. Look, I know, <laughs> I know this is getting, um, this is getting a bit complicated, but where you see complexity, I, no, I, I can't justify this at all. This is just the way I'm doing it. This is just the way I'm doing it. I honestly can't justify this, but in my head it works. So yay. I did, I mean, I wanted, I wanted all the scrap processing to be further away anyway, because I kind of didn't like how cramped it was. Now I don't know if, I don't know if this is necessarily better, but it's, oh no, you're not there. 
No. You... Oh. Wait, hang on. Oh no, what have I done? Oh no, I've completely... So I'm going to have them place onto that, but then something from that end needs to grab to place there. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's okay. It's all right. It's fine. That's going to go there. That's going to go there. That, that's going to that's gonna go there. This one is going to be for... Uh, what is it? <laughs> lithium, the whole point of doing this. Oh my gosh. That one's going to be for lithium. I kind of love how needlessly complicated this is getting. This is this is this is absolutely in my wheelhouse. I'm not going for efficiency here, obviously. I'm just going for what works and what is fun. But I do need more space. <laughs> this is getting huge. Can I move that out of the way and that out of the way? Because those need to move even further. Ay ay ay. Uh ooh. Oh, here's a question. Can we carry this while on the surfboard? Skateboard, we can. Holy crap. This thing's incredible. This is like the single best hoverboard. That's it. This is the single best thing in the entire game now. My goodness. Hmm. Hmm. Next question. Next question. So I want these to produce and then hand over to... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, no, I've got this. I've got this. Just, you know, trust me. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. I, I know what I'm doing. This is definitely going to work, right? <laughs> this is so complicated. Oh, my gosh. Oh, why have I done this? Why have I done this? Well, I don't need that. Why? Why have I done this? I need... Two more arms. Two more auto arms. No, actually, I think I even need more than that. So let's just make three. Let's just let's just make three because I think I'm going to need more than two. I just know there are going to be so many of you in the comments just going, but why are you doing that? Why are you doing it this way? You're making it so complicated. And to you, I say, yes, I am. I don't know why I am, but I am. <laughs> And you'll be happier. You'll be happier if you just let this happen, right? Just just don't worry about it. Just don't worry about it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. I have this horrible feeling this is going to be a really long episode because I'm just faffing about so much. But I, I'm kind of enjoying doing longer episodes from time to time. So I'm kind of okay with it. Oh, why is that? Oh, why is Oh, it's such a... Oh, I don't want it at that jaunty angle. Thanks. I want this in a straight line. Straight line. Uh, you... Yeah, you're set up good. Yep, you're fine. Can you reach everything on that? No, I don't think you can. That's fine. We'll just position you there. Now you can. It's good. And we'll get you there. That's very good. It's nearly done though. Like, it's it's coming together. This this daft, absolutely daft, insane plan is coming together bit by bit. You just gotta trust me, right? You just gotta trust. Trust that I have some idea of what I'm doing. I do sometimes wish there was a grid I could align things to, so I knew these were gonna be even, but I'm get it's I'm gonna line it up as best I can, basically. So now, you... Okay, okay, so here, now, 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 everybody, everybody. So, I... <laughs> There's a couple of ways I could do this last bit of it, right? Oh, I need more soil. I need more soil so I can finish flattening this area. So I could have it... I could have it as it was before, where this little... This little printer just dumps them on the ground. Just dumps them on the ground and the arms have to deal with it. But if this is just going to be running permanently, that means any time I leave the planet, they're just going to be everywhere. It's it's not a good idea. That that part of this that that part of this is not a good idea. So, I'm going to do what I've done for the RTG factory. I'm going to have it fill up a uh, like a, a a container, a platform, a silo, whatever with the canisters and as it fill, once it fills up, I'll have a little sensor to get it to switch off. Easy peasy. Uh, it's going to be brilliant. It's like so, so simple. So simple. So, oh, that means we do need... Oh, that's ugly. That's ugly. There you go. That does mean we're going to need... 
<laughs> I knew I'd need it. Another arm. Yep, need this. Oh, we're gonna need another, another arm too. Oh, gee whiz. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So, we need that to place. No, no, no. That's gonna place them on the thing. Then we need, yeah, these to take the canisters off and place them into the shredders. Yes, I know what I'm doing. Okie dokie. There's our, there's our storage silo. Love it. That's, can they both reach that? They can. Excellent. And that will build on to that. We'll grab you. Storage sensor. Onto you. So full or empty, full or not full. Plug you in. Last, last but not least, at least for this this bit. I actually, oh, I need to make a train car. <laughs> I forgot about that. That's fine. No, 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 no. I didn't want to. I didn't want to pick those up. Okay. Last but not least. these little guys which are gonna go oh okay need to do a little bit little bit more flattening just a little little, little bit a little bit more flattening are you there you're gonna go there <laughs> this is so stupid i love it oh my gosh oh hey i had a platform there oh it's okay do i have another arm there no 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 i don't it's all right uh, oh, 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 uh, let's unplug that, plug you there, plug that, and that, yep, 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 so that, that one there, that one there is going to be for the, uh, for the, for the, why can I never remember what it's called, lithium, for the lithium, and our train car, I need a train car, rail car, and the very final piece is one of those, a large storage, so, and I have no idea what that needs, so I need to wait for this to finish. That was taking forever to print, so I did the smart thing, looked it up in the research catalog. It needs three ceramic. If I can even find it, there it is. Okay, oh yeah. The thing I'm most curious out of this is, can that reach everything that's on there, or do I need to lower it? There is every possibility that I'm gonna need to lower it, but if I can leave it up there, that'd be ideal. I really just wanna keep it up there in the air. So right, let's grab our storage sensor. Let's go on to that. Switch it to full or empty. Send it away. Send it away. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, I gotta, oh, I gotta turn these on. I'm gonna turn these on. Uh, I've gotta plug them in too. That would help. That could go there. And that one. Yeah, we go. Turn all of them on, turn that on. Oh sweet, okay, so first question answered. Yes, those can deposit onto that. Fantastic. Now I really just want to see that the whole system works. But you own you on. So I've grabbed some uh I've grabbed a bit more resin. So I can manually load this up. On two, three, and four. One of these will be done in a second. There it is, it's done. It'll load onto there. Lovely, lovely. Okay, that bit works. Ooh, we may be a little low on power. That's all right, I can place some RTGs after this. So that should be... <laughs> yes. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Wait. Hang on. Hang. Oh. <laughs> okay, well that was interesting. All right, will that return? It returns. Okay. That bit works. This bit works. That arm grabbed the printer and chucked it into the shredder. <laughs> What did I do up here? What did I do up here so that it worked properly? Oh yeah! 
Ah, uh, oh, right. I had it just dropping them on the ground, and then the the arm picks them up and puts them on the thing. Right. Right. And then when that's full, it turns it all off. Right. Okay. All right. Slight redesign required. So. So. Let's move this. Oh, I need I need more space. I mean, I could just use that. No, no, no. Let's do it prop. Oh, what's that? Oh, that'll do. Yeah, I meant to do that. I I knew I knew I'd need that. So it's all good. Yeah, this is all fine. This is all going to be fine. This is all going to be absolutely fine. Now I just need a small printer, which needs compound. Oh no, there's, there's a huge amount of compound underneath here, which I can't get at. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I've got compound just over here. Also, if you're wondering why this is at a weird angle, I forgot to turn on true flat on the on my gun. I forgot to turn the alignment tool back on. It's fine. I might fix that later. I might not. It depends how much I care about it. No, you bastard! Stop! 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 No! Crap! <laughs> so, so good! Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Canister. 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 Oh wait, 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 I haven't turned this on. Also, you need that. <laughs> you need that. Thank you. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, let's pod that in there. Alright, activates blah blah blah. I'm going to turn these off, make sure this bit works. Cycle mode is empty or not empty. Well, let's see. Okay, yep, yep. It's gonna fill up. Good. I don't know how that resin got there, but okay. Well, no, 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 no. Oh, far out. How did that get attached to the resin instead of this? You meant to be attached to that. Oh, gosh, wow. Just, okay. So that's gonna, that's gonna fill up. Oh, that's interesting. It stopped working entirely because I, I guess it can't reach the other spots? I guess? Hmm. Purely for the purposes of checking if this actually works. i turn that on. I've turned this thing around. I'll figure this out in a sec. It just needs a larger platform. Okay, well clearly that's not worked. No, neither has that. Why doesn't this work? Why? What have I? What have I done wrong? What have I done wrong? That is causing this to not work. Let me just go check what I did up here again. Okay. Will you work now? No. Why? Why is the storage sensor not working anymore? I really don't understand this. I've got it set up exactly as I've set it up up on the hill there. Okay, so I've done a little bit of research online, looking around the Wikipedia and a few other things, and just generally Googling, and I discovered something. Storage sensors do not detect empty soil canisters. I don't know why. I think that's really dumb. I mean, I can understand they want to delineate between a full and an empty one for the purposes of a storage sensor, but to have no way of detecting them at all? I don't get that. I, and I've, I've, I cannot figure any other way of doing this. So, what I'm going to have to do is whenever going off world, going to have to turn this off, otherwise they are going to go everywhere. And for now, it'll just have to dump them in a pit and we'll have two of these, two of these auto arms grabbing from the pit, putting on this, grabbing those. I did think of one thing though to do. Uh, oh, I need to go grab the storage sensor. Nope, had it on me the entire time. They always kind of camouflage. So, if I connect that to that, right? Gosh, this is... <laughs> I might need to swap this out for the smaller one. But let's see. Let's see, how far can this reach? Uh, not really far enough. All right, so we'll go there. And we'll go there. And we'll go there. And then we'll go there. So... Now, when this is full, so full or not full, okay, when this is full, it'll turn off the printer. It's going to take a while to fill it, 
like that takes 400 units i may need to switch it out for the smaller one but at the very least let's just see this whole system in action hey let's just turn those on turn that on yep yep they're grabbing them they're sticking them in the grinder these are on let's turn output on for this yes yes turn that back on it's gonna make so many of these so quickly <laughs> oh gosh hopefully hopefully those auto arms can deal with it and then these are full yeah well they're nearly full they're now f okay yeah come on fill up there we go so that mm, nearly full so that's full Turn those off. Send that away. Send that away. On, 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 off. And now when these rockets return, they've got lithium. The lithium gets removed. The lithium gets placed in this canister. And we're good to go again. All right, it works. It's not perfect. It's not perfect, but it works. Oh, look at that. That thing ran through all that resin really quickly. That's gonna be a stopgap, right? That's gonna be a stopgap. Whenever these this thing brings over a full load, it'll be a load of eight. So this will be able to make eight canisters which I think will amount to like three or four pieces of scrap. But anyway, now I can just leave this running. I can just leave this running. And if I'm planning an extended trip away from silver, I just turn off the printer. I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that because then over time this will refill. I think this is going to work. I may need to switch this one and that one. Maybe have the big one over there and the little one here. But anyway, it's done and it works. But before we finish up, this hoverboard is amazing. Before we finish up, I'm going to start setting up all of these as part of our power grid. Whoops, didn't mean to put that away. Uh, yep. Like that. Plug you into there, and then this into here. There we go. The start of including full size RTGs in the overall power grid. But for now, ladies and gentlemen, I think that'll do. <laughs> this has been, I think this has been quite a long episode, but I've managed to get this thing working the way I wanted, finally. And I've learnt something about empty canisters, which is a little annoying, but here we are. But thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. This episode was brought to you by my very generous patrons.